Hi guys, so take a look at this up one up. We are done cooking. Oh my god, guys, order for yours. This up one is so good and so fresh without frying it. This up one soup is very, very good. It goes with everything. Hi guys, good evening, everyone. So today I'm making a soup called up one soup, and here I have beef meat, but more pepper and my opono and my stockfish and ususa leaf i have here onion and this is the spices i'm using to cook my opono because i don't want to use maki in this opono and i don't want i don't like too much frying of a, of a soup so i don't want to fry this opono so i want to take you guys along the way I make my opono soup without frying. So if it's the kind of person that doesn't like to fry, that you don't, you don't like too much frying stuff, please taste you and watch to the end. And this is the fish I'm using in this opono. So let's start the cooking now. So if you're the kind of person that doesn't like too much frying stuff, I think this video is for you. Please guys, let's start the cooking. And here is the pot I'm using. So guys, inside this pot we have the meat and some chopped onions and pepper. And here is my season I'm using to steam the meat with. So here it is. Can you guys see? So this is what I'm using to cook the soup because I don't want to use maki on this soup, okay? And I don't want to fry the oak burner. So please guys, watch this video to the end. So guys, this is another 5 minutes time that this soup has been cooked. So what I'm putting now is the pomo. to let it to cook. So here we put meat and the quama. The next thing I'm putting is the stockfish. And you can see so let it to cook for another two minutes and we come to add water. Remember, we are not frying this up burner because we are not going to fry the up burner. We are going to cook it just like that. And I'm taking you guys along everything I'm doing today. So guys, time to Add water inside the pot and also add some of the fish. And you also add the palm oil. And let it to be cooked. So guys, now that the oil is well cooked, can you guys see? And here is our corner. So let me show you what you're going to do with this corner. First of all, you're going to take some of the water. This is the soup water. Can you guys see what I'm doing? Over the pot. Here is the oak burner with the hot soup stock. So, and 
keep mixing. So guys, now that we finish mixing the okbono with the hot water that is the stock, can you guys see? So let's go back to the pot. Here is our pot, and here is our okbono. So we are going to put the okbono now inside the soup. So guys, we are finished putting the okbono. Can you guys see? This is the okbono. We are finished putting it. So guys, I have to test this soup. Okay? I will show you guys when I'm putting this soup. It's very nice. It's not until you put maki and crayfish inside soup before the soup will taste nice. Even if you don't add maki, but you add this this particular flavor I'm showing to you guys on your food guys you enjoy the food too this is what I'm using to cook the soup guys it's just like my kitchen it is well seasoned this is what I'm using to cook the food can you guys see so I have to test guys I'm telling you Upon up with that frying give you another flavor like another taste and you can smell the upono very nice very good give you another test try this soup without frying your upono just try it like this you will like it okay so guys let's cover this pot for the upono to be well cooked i will come back and show you guys everything So guys, let's check the pot now. Can you guys see this pot? So the last thing we are putting inside this pot is our azusa leaf. This is the end of this cooking. Please subscribe to my channel, like and share, and turn on your post notification. God bless you. Bye. I'll see you guys in my next video. Hi guys. So take a look at this up one up. We are done cooking. Oh my God, guys. Order for yours. This up one is so good and so fresh without frying it this okbono soup is very very good it goes with everything guys can you guys see this okbono can you guys see how good is this okbono look like can you see guys very simple cooking so if you're the type that doesn't like too much maki on your food i think you can go with that spices and if you are the type that doesn't like frying your opponent, this is so perfect, okay? So, bye! Please don't forget to subscribe in this channel, likes, and share. Turn on your post notification. Bye, guys. See you guys in my next video. Bye!